I'm, I'm Teresa. I am the uh, executive food designer for Ang Lee's movie, Eat, Drink, Man, Woman, and also the catering director for his movie, Life of Pi. And I host the radio and TV cooking show. And today I'm going to stew a very home style ginseng chicken soup for you. I love ginseng because my family, we love to use it to cook the soup, especially the fresh American ginseng. The flavor is so good. I call it the immune system booster because it helps you and also helps you uh, circulation. We Chinese consider qi is very important. When you have qi, you have the spirit, you have the energy, right? So the uh, American fresh ginseng will really help you to uh, boost your immune system. This is the American fresh ginseng. And if it is not in the season, we will use the dry ginseng here. They're like a stalk, and you can cut them into pieces. So uh, this is the free ranch chicken. When you're going to uh, boil it, we always save the uh, chicken feet. Why do you want to save it? Because the chicken feet will have a lot of gel. It makes the soup really thick and delicious. You will boil the chicken. So the blood will be gone, and the whole chicken will be taste better. All the other country doesn't have this kind of American uh, ginseng. They have uh, their different ginseng, especially in China or in Korea. Uh, up on the hill, they have this kind of uh, uh, wild ginseng. But that kind of ginseng is different from here because they, they, are, uh, they are not only wild, they are very hot. When I come over to the United States, I learned that we have the fresh American ginseng. I get to know it because of, uh, the shoes are ginseng, right? So the, the shoes are ginseng group actually sponsor us to uh, share the healthy cooking uh, with all the audience in uh, LA area, but also all over the America, New York, Chicago, all the people can learn from us to make themselves uh, healthy. These are the basic three. We have red date, goji berry, and Chinese yam. Every family will have them at home, so that will be very nutritious. So right now, I am putting all these uh, American fresh ginseng into the soup, and you will soak the red date for like 10 minutes, then the Chinese yam to it. You soak them into the water for 10 minutes too. My secret recipe is the white peppercorn. You just add like one teaspoon. So finally, we add the Chinese rice wine. My family always cook the soup. Soup is so important to us. It's kind of like a mother's food. So when you're going anywhere, you miss your hometown, you miss your mother, and we tie together no matter how far it is. We will always love each other. This is very important to me. So we will usually cook this for two or three hours until all the good flavor comes out. So right now, when it is boiling, let's take a look at this. It is really boiling. Look at it. Wow. So right now, I am going to just add my goji berry because these are very good for your uh, eyes. So you will have a shining eyes, very sharp like an eagle. And I'm adding the seasoning, the sea salt to it. Not too many, not too much of them. Okay, this is how you cook. So finally, if you want to add a little bit of flavor, you can uh, slice some shredded uh, green onion. Give it a little bit green touch and make it look very vivid. That's how you make the home style Chinese soup with the fresh American ginseng and chicken. <laughs>